This is Alamin. He lives in one of the poorest slums in Taka City's Karan Bazar area. His father and mother are day laborers. But Alamin and his fellow students have bigger plans. They want to be filmmakers, doctors, and teachers. When I grow up, I want to work with cameras like you and take pictures and make movies. Because I'm going to school, I'm going to grow up to be smart, and I know I can do this. <laughs> Alamin and his friends are pupils at a makeshift school run by a few local university students. It's called a free school, founded by Rezwan Ahmed Rozail and Moshed Alam Koshik. It doesn't look like much, but it's a pretty big deal for the children here. There aren't any other schools for them to go to. These students have a lot of desire to improve themselves. They want to lift themselves out of the situation they found themselves in. The Karan Bazar area is notorious as a marketplace for illegal drugs, and many of the kids who live here work in the drug trade. Kaushik and Rosale had to think creatively to keep the children away from the lure of drug money. This woman is cutting up rotten fruit that's already been thrown away. That is what these kids eat. So Rosale and Kaushik have figured out that one of the ways to make sure these kids keep coming to school is to give them some food. Despite the loss of potential income, most parents are happy that their kids are getting an education. I won't send my child to work. His childhood is his childhood. It will go away soon. He can work when he's an adult. As long as I have the strength to keep working, I'm going to make sure my son studies in school. It's baby steps so far for a free school, but they have big dreams. And so do these kids. Mahar Sattar, Al Jazeera, Dhaka.